The Bornholmerstrasse border barrier was raised at 20 past 9 p.m. on the 9th of November. To know how the Berlin Wall began to crumple, we have to back up a couple of hours. Earlier that evening, government spokesman Gunter Schabowski had announced, prematurely as it happened, that new regulations would let East Germans travel to the West freely as of now. The news spread like a wildfire. Ordinary Berliners swarmed the wall. The guards had not been told ahead of time, and at first it was touch and go, them trying to keep order, using water cannon, for example. A former opponent of the communist regime, Ralph Hirsch, reminds us that the events of that night took everyone in the German Democratic Republic by surprise. He says there were many fears. The first concern was that a border guard would shoot someone. We knew there had been a firing order, there had been deaths on the wall, and if someone had overreacted and perhaps fired off his weapon, the outcome would have been quite different. That peaceful revolution, that opening of the wall, nobody automatically assumed it would be like that. In 1989, the Cold War was still on. The Iron Curtain dividing Europe into blocks was still up just not for much longer. Some scenes were comical. It just beggared belief people still remember today. Berliner Rainer Melink tells us, I was at home working on the house and didn't realize what was happening. When I sat down in front of the TV and saw the border opened, I actually thought it was a fictional movie. I couldn't believe it. I kept wondering, how did they film that? What an exciting movie. But when I switched channels, it was always the same, and that didn't make sense. I only realized it had really happened the next day. The most hardline of Soviet satellite states transformed as if shot from a catapult, where a people had been ringed by the wall and its bunkers and searchlights and spied on from within by the hated Stasi's secret police. Despair gave way to joy. Eyewitness Isolde Nedbol recalls, back then we had a trabi. We drove off in the car with the kids to see what was happening. It still brings tears to my eyes when I think about it today. Within less than a year of the wall coming down, open elections had been held, borders were redrawn, the GDR was dissolved, and East and West Germany declared themselves to be one country again.